down to 7, 1 through 7, 3, which has to do with addition, subtraction, and multiplication. And we are going to start with number 3. So whenever I'm dealing with anything that's multiplication, you can make it into a box. So I'm going to put negative 2x squared on the outside, and it's just going to be a 1 by 2 box. And 3x to the 5th, and negative x to the 3rd, right? Negative 2 times 3 is negative 6. When we multiply exponents, we multiply them together, right? So we get x to the 10th. And then negative 2 times a negative is a positive 2. x squared and x to the 3rd is x to the 5th. The exponents are all different. Whenever they're not the multiplication. When, because this is multiplication, though. The multiplication, you have to get right. everything. Yeah, and with addition and subtraction, you can't. So we get negative 6x to the 10th. Plus 2x to the fifth. Yes, sir. Didn't you multiply the x when you did the exponent? Oh, I should have. 2 times 3 is 6. This should have been 6. Sorry, guys. No, this is 6. Yes, sir. So in the homework, there might have been a plus sign in between these, and then you would plus. Yeah. Yeah. So where what are you asking for for the fourth? Oh, no. so if it's if it was let's say um, the top left three x to the fifth, that would be two. Yeah, it would be to the fourth. Yeah. So four is another one of that. Yeah. So what would that box look like? How many terms are in here? Two. So I know I need to have at least two, right? So if we go here, what's the second one? How many terms are there? Three. Three, so I need to have three. See how that works, Kayla? Seven. So no, you can't see how that works because you can't see. Okay, is that better? Negative 2 times m squared is negative 2m to the third. m times 5m is 5m squared. m times negative 1 is negative m. 3 times negative 2m squared is negative 6m squared. 3 times 5m is 15m. 3 times negative 1 is negative 10. Did you do the, the lines for this? Yes. And then you just add the The like terms, yep, yes, they have the, like the same terms. exponents and the same letters. So there's only one that has to the third, right? So I put that one down first. There's two that are squared, so I put them together. So I get negative 1 m squared. There's two that have an m, so I get 14 m. And then I've got a negative 3 at the end. All right, let's look at number 10. And then I'm probably going to let you guys... Work on this on your own. Yes? What is yeah. small number three? Small three. It's a box. Oh, what do I call the answer? It is, so we know if we have one, it's a monomial. Two is a binomial. Three is a trinomial. And then it's a polynomial. So it's a Cubic polynomial. Why is it cubic? Because it cubic means to the third power. Yes. I have a question. So when you're trying to find the exponent when you do this, like negative two m squared and then yeah. m, and then it becomes three. So you're adding like the non-existent exponent, which you know is one. But then for like the one next to it, it was times and then. Oh. Because I'm silly. This is. This is not right. This is to the seventh power. I don't know what happened to me, guys. I'm sorry. And this is to the fifth, because you're just supposed to add them. I don't know what happened. Because I had my mind like exploded and didn't work correctly. And that was because you didn't add the exponent? Yeah, like we always have. The rules didn't suddenly change. I don't know what's wrong with me. Okay, 
Let's look at number 10, and then we'll do another problem like that one so you guys don't. Okay. So am I. We're fine. Okay. Number 10, what is the degree? Three. Three. What's the leading coefficient? Five. Is it a monomial, binomial, or trinomial? Binomial. Look at it again. Binomial. How many oh, terms are there? Binomial. Uh, so it's binomial. binomial, like a bicycle. Three, negative five, binomial. Come on, you know this. All right, let's do number three. Okay, do you want me to do it in a box again or do you want me to just show you how you do it like distribution? Can you do both? Yes. Okay, let's look at it like distribution, right? Okay, so x times x to the third is x to the fourth. Uh, it's on the back. x times 8x is 8x to the third. x times negative 4 is negative 4x squared. And x times 2 is 2x. Oh, wait, no, that's Okay, here's the box way. Okay, I've got x on the outside, and then I've got 1, 2, 3, 4. x to the third, 8x, negative 4x, and 2. This will be x to the fourth, 8x is 8x squared. Thank you. 8x to the third. Negative 4x squared, 2x. Both ways. All right, guys. I'm going to let you work on this. You've got nine questions on the back here. And you've got one, two, three, four, five, six, seven questions on the front. You can do it. 